game or not. I was the same way, but I heard this guy's voice. Oh, I'm not gonna say that was enough for me, but other you other you guys might be kinda picky. Alright. Blast. Light. Light hit these. Alright, where's the disruptor at? That's what I'm gonna kill, but I can't. So. Blight him, blight you. Everybody gets a blight. You get a blight. Poison. I've always lost my fucking sunlight. It's almost. Or my torch is almost out. Death waits. Ah, uh, don't die, bitch. Concentration. Cow traps. Who do I want? No, I don't want him. Stun and kick back to you. Hmm. Oh, we fucking kill him! I love when you get that crit. <laughs> That's why I love the bounty hunter. Fucking crit. Just get him. Well, let's heal. Let's heal my guy. I love the herbalist. She can at least heal. Anytime you have somebody that can heal, it's worth keeping. Alright. Once again, we talked about that stun. Bam. Stun him. Give my guy a chance to heal. Kill my guy again. The blight is about to take him out. Dives, good man. Crusader, I love it. Bam. Get rid of my bleed. Awesome. Finish. Ah! No fucking crit. It's alright. Smite. Smite me. Dead, bitch. Give them no quarter. Not even trying to win, and my team is going through. Yeah, finish this guy off. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. All right, got some loot. See, they do stupid shit like that. I can't control that. I know you guys like, if they do stupid shit, just stop them. Look like he got a good perk, so. Show you guys what happens when a torch goes out. <laughs> Thinking bullshit. Terrors may indeed All right. stalk these shadows, but yonder, a glint of gold. Shit, I hate when they do that. And like any RPG, anytime your shit gets out of order, you're in trouble. Fuck! Hate those moves. Shit! Well, at least my doctor can cure itself, but I'm way out of order. Stun, clean all corpses. No, I need you to move. I need you to back back. Caltrips. Bleed. Shit. It's not looking good right now. I could move forward with one of these. Dead, bitch! Back to almost ideal position. Good. Gotta get my bounty hunter back up though. Good. You fucking coward, scoop to the back. Dare you fuck with Kilgrod? 
All right, what are you gonna do? Just more cow traps, bleed this bitch out. Fuck, okay. Finish it. Get enough. That bitch down there should be going soon. Actually, oh, this is actually where I want him. Keep him right there. I want to use my bandages. I don't want my crusader to go down. In the fever pitch of battle. The accusation. Get both of them bitches. Die! Fucking would kill cry. Kill cry. Oh, you fucking heathen. Put down your gun and fight me like a man. Fucking stress. Stun one of these bitches. You can't heal yourself. You're useless. Stun him. Move him back. Dead, bitch. My money grab round might actually <laughs> go somewhere. Ah! Die, bitch! You fucking the cunt. slow death, unforeseen, unforeseen. unforgiving. Heal the good doctor. Good. Six. Oh, Could have actually been healed by fucking self with the bandages, but haven't been dead. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. Trying to show you guys a, a money grab run. And then I'll probably just be um, streaming when I'm going on a boss run. Show you guys the mechanics for my failed attempts. And <laughs> if that helps. Oh, I got a shovel. If that helps you guys, then I'm all for it. Hey. Investigate. As you can see, my stress is still pretty low for these guys. 43, 12, 16, 48. Like we talked about in the intro part one, you want to keep an eye on your fucking stress meter, man. Seriously. Ew. My map is scouting. See, that's good. I'll tell you where to avoid traps at. See, we're almost done with the map, but... A holy relic. That's one. Two more relics before we complete. You may be done with the money grab. We're all about to fucking die. I don't think it's smart to keep going. atmosphere this shit. Now that big ass monster I told you about, that shit still can come on any time. Hmm, what do we have here? Don't do anything stupid, you fucking bamboo. Now usually when you're exploring this long, the game asks you to eat, which is a pain in the ass if you don't have any food, it fucks up your whole place. Oh. <laughs> what did I just say? If you don't eat, it fucks you up. Since this is a money grab, and I'm just showing you what, you know, what goes on. I'm going to show you what happens if you don't eat. This is going to be very fucking stupid. But, if it helps you guys, I'm going to do it and show you what happens when you don't eat. When you don't have food. But in my case, I do have food, but for the sake of the tutorial, I'm going to show you what happens when you don't eat. So I'm going to starve. To fall Look at that shit. Such a I lost health. Thing. Look at my stress a now. Bite of bread. Everybody, 68. It went from 12 to 68. This guy, 35. 
it, it, it fucks you up. You want to eat, man. So we're probably going to die, and on that note, we're going to get out of here. The money grab was successful so far. Yes. We fall so that we may learn to pick ourselves up. And you want you get again. money and you want to dip out, man. Don't even don't even risk it. Get the shit you need, dip out. Bam! Look at that. All the heirlooms we got. Trade this shit in. Get more relics, get us more gold. Bam. Oh shit, they got good quirks. Except for this dude. Fear of beasts. Fuck. Skilled gambler. Increased chance. How the fuck does that help me? I mean, gambling what? At the tavern or like actually in the fucking rooms? I don't know. They don't explain that. No stress penalty when walking backwards. Alright, whatever. 5% virtue chance. Yeah. I've had worse money a grabs. irritant to some. A sanguine memory to me. Alright, and you can see from the log, it tells you what's going on. Town events. Stress reduction are slightly less effective. It tells me what happened. We were doing that, but we fled. And yeah, we got some gold. And that's how you get gold. You want to throw some heroes in there. You don't give a fuck about. Get as much money as you can. Run away. Your people in this game, like we said before, don't get attached to your heroes. They are expendable. People die. They die all the time in this game. They don't come back. Build your characters you do like. Try to keep them alive. And those are the ones you want to level and you want to upgrade. But it takes money. And like I said, like we said, part one. Bam, look. I got more heroes. So they keep coming. So why would you not risk them? You know, keep risking them. Get what you can. You always want a full roster. So some of these dudes, I'm probably going to let go. Like I said, it's, it's no point in me trying to get their stress down when I can just let them go. Except if it's a class you really need at the end. Like, the Crusader, he's too good. I'm not going to let him go right now. Or maybe I will. Him, he can go. You know, like I said, it just keep your money. Don't, you know, keep your fucking money. Don't just throw shit out. Jay, probably use you for a money grab later on. This dude, you can go. I'm just get another one. I'm not gonna pay. It is done. Turn it's almost like pussy. Don't pay for pussy when you get it for free. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um. Let's see, we let a guy go. I want get another guy. Get another man at arms. Uh, but I think the the arbalist is better. It's because that self heal is always good. Oh, Satan Topia, are you afraid of demons or some shit? Oh gosh, just as the holy. Hmm. Got no level one. Yeah, let's get you. So you see that? I saved money. Bandage and pillage. Got rid of the heroes. dancing steps of war. Bam. I need to heal V. Stress is kind of high. Oh, as you can see, 67. It's not too much, but I like it at zero because I'll be using her pretty soon to go on a major raid. And when I go on major raids, I like my people to be ready. So V, I'm going to send to some shit and probably Mr. J. Mr. J, Mr. J! They'll send to some stress relief. Treatment war. That's how you get rid of uh, treatment wars. We can get rid of quirks and shit like that that you don't want on your hero. Sometimes your heroes get, you know, diseases, as you can see from right here. Um, yeah, they can get diseases like gonorrhea, chlamydia, STDs, and yeah. <laughs> don't ask, but you can. They got some diseases in this game I've never fucking heard of. So if you want to cure them, that's where you go. Um, send them to the abbey. Yeah, it's pretty cheap when I'm gonna have you. Mr. J, 850, firm treatment. 
V. We also need to go here. I like to treat my my healers. It's hard to find a good healer, like most RPGs. I like to keep them in check, keep them good. All right, rest of my guys are in check. Um, we're gonna look at some of the trinkets we got. Keep stress down, book of relaxation uncommon. There's also a lady right here that you unlock after you do enough missions. Well, oh, excuse me, she gives, she sells you trinkets, but. As you can see, they're expensive as shit. <laughs> I don't buy a goddamn thing from her, but there you go. She has it. And when you upgrade her, she gets better items. So, alright. Let's uh, let's see, what are we looking at? Oh yeah, we're going back to our trinkets. Seeing what we got. Stress it while camping. Scouting chance. Abomination. Give this to one of them. Swift cloak, move resist. Oh, one of my guys can wear that. That'll be nice. Hmm. Who one of my favorite abominations that I like? Bow leaf. Let's see. I had one with a rabies touch. Just love. Maniac for money. Oh, aren't we all? I think it was Lovecraft. Yes. Let's give it to Lovecraft. He'll be great with that trinket. So I'll go back. Yeah, I'm also showing you guys how to equip trinkets. It was kind of fucking confusing at first. Bam. There we go with that. I can see on this dodge. Now I'm going to sell that. Probably going to sell that one to Swift Cloak. Uncommon move resist. This will be good for one of your tanks. You know, anything where you don't get moved or you stay, that's what you want your tanks to wear. And my tanks usually are my leper and pyramid head right now. 10% mm, damage in position 1. Don't want to get rid of that. Then he gets max HP. So, no, I don't want him to get rid of that. Um, so like I said, you guys, I'm still figuring this shit out. I'm not an expert in these fucking items, you know. <laughs> Try, fail, you know, a bunch of times to succeed, so. What do I have on Brock? Lesnar, okay, no, not Brock Lesnar. Move resist, he already has some move resist shit, but I'm going to give him even more, because believe it or not, you get fucking move resisted a lot, which pisses me off. Bam, take that off. Now my move resist is up, baby. I won't be moved out of the way so easily. Common dodge chance. Stress. Book relaxation. Probably keep that. Uncommon. Common. Need to sell all these. I don't want to, but I need to go. I really do. Trying to do a boss fight. And we'll see what time is it. Maybe I can get a boss fight in. Show you guys the real struggle and character. You can see the fight for your granny. Let's see. Sale. That's all the fuck they gave me was $750. That's bullshit. Healed while camping. Scouting chance. That's fucking lame. I guess you can't underestimate scaling though, that does help. Especially when you're trying to find a boss. So maybe we will keep that. One of our bounty hunters, I think we only got one. And he's level two. That's good. Alright. So now you have seen Kilgron. Descend to the darkest fucking dungeon and put sword in ass for Kilgrania. Join me for part three as we go to another boss raid. Ah, oh, bitches.